future of Vault Dwellers of Vault 459? I am Overseer T Mac, the Overseer of this here vault. And today, I am accepting applications for your stay at Vault 459. Look at this here sample apartment I've built. Now it is your job to create and customize your own apartment by following the rules and regulations you can choose one of these here pre-built uh, spaces and customize it as you like to make your stay here more comfortable but first let me review the rules and regulations of the application that you have been given in the vault admittance book it says dear future dweller of vault 459 in the event of the inevitable apocalypse of some sort congrats on your recent inclusion in the vault 459 community you will find outlined in the, your in your application materials a full pres A full list of procedures related to preparing for shelter in Vault Tech facility. Now your house prep. To get to your vault apartment, you will need to find your way into the yellow area, which is the residential area, which is where I am right now. From there you have s From there we have some pre-built skeletons of apartments, but we are giving you free reign over which apartment you claim is yours. All you need to do is decorate it and customize it however you like that would make you most comfortable. The only rules are you cannot remove the stone or clay from the, from the walls, but you may add walls to separate some more rooms if you like. And you can also change the floor like to carpet if you want, but you also can't break the roof unless you're adding the lighting. But the lighting must be redstone tor lanterns and the builder materials are up to you so don't be snooping around in the vault storage room because if you do you will be shot on sight maybe probably not but don't do it the room also may not contain any bathroom or shower of any kind as those are provided by the vault they are not built yet but they will be and as for your personal items, all personal items will be reviewed and approved by an authorized vault tech. And yeah. And in the event of an emergency entrance to the vault, no personal belongings will be permitted beyond the main door. In the event of an actual or drill vault activation, a vault tech will sound a siren audible in the immediate vicinity of the vault residents will also be contacted personally after which you will need to report promptly to vault 459 to await admittance and processing vault tech looks forward to having you as a valued resident in vault 459 sincerely team extra 409 overseer of vault 409 vault tech fort lookout minecraftia so that's the book you will be receiving if you receive it uh, that means you have been accepted into the Vault 409 in the event of an apocalypse and you can choose one of these rooms more rooms will be built so if you want to wait for a bigger one you may do so but these are the smallest rooms and then these ones are a little bit bigger and then currently we only have one really big room so it's first come first serve at the moment but there should be more rooms this size in the future um, but yeah, now we have to go deliver these notes so people know they're allowed in here and they can customize their room. This is the one I have customized. You got a big screen TV watching a Jackie Chan movie or something like that. Computer, cactus, clock, and then a double bed even though he sleeps alone. Yep. So the first person we're going to visit also lives within the walls of Fort Lookout. They live on atop a ziggurat, well not on top, inside a ziggurat. And 
they live just right over here. So they're going to be the first person we deliver this to just because they're the closest. Uh, there's going to be six people in total we deliver to. <clears throat> I think six at least, for now. Six is enough, people. Alright, so we put in here, put one of the books in here. Vault admittance I'll just put vault admittance alright so now we're going off to a close friend of mine we have similar names his name is JMac he is the next closest person that we're going to deliver to We'll just do it right here. Hmm. Yeah, right here is good. All right, next place is let's see. Probably a man by the name of Go Bulls. Here we are, Goebbels base. Vault admittance. Right now, I think we'll go to a feared person by the name of Shadow Matter. Uh, pretty much just because the other two people are on right now and that would kind of be awkward. Alright, we got Shadow Matter. The next two people are on the server, so hopefully they're not at their base right now. Alright, next stop, I guess Lego Man. His base is big, probably won't see me. Hopefully, because that'd be really awkward. Right. Now let's leave this place before he finds me. And our last subject. There. So hopefully soon enough we will have people in the vault creating their whatever. And this was a very special occasion because usually the overseer of the vault doesn't do all this crap. Usually it's like a Department of Public Relations person or something, but no. You guys should be honored. The Overseer himself did it. But yeah, I just... My, I created some shells of rooms. Or apartments, whatever you want to call them. And I'm going to have people... Like I just delivered. The people on the server are going to choose a room. And they are going to customize it, hopefully, because I don't really want to customize all the rooms. Why is there always a minecart right here? Nope. Woo, that was close. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be the end of this episode. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya!